Hi. Um, I actually announced at the start of this, this series about a month ago now, and when I tried to upload the first episode, it was half an hour long, so I'm going to do a shorter video today because apparently I was, I'm was i only allowed to upload 15 minute videos, which is fucked up, and I'm not sure how to change it, it says I have changed it and it doesn't register, but yeah, I'm Um, yeah, this is the first episode of the Conspiracy Theories video. I'm absolutely fucking exhausted. Um, and the first episode will be on the, basically the start of, um, Conspiracy Theories. And, and a date that's now been filled with superstition superstition and so yeah the well part of the reason I am doing it on this subject is because it's twenty fourteen and it's gone to the end of twenty fourteen and seven hundred years earlier this year, seven hundred years was Ago in on May the 18th, I think 700 years ago this year. On May the 18th is uh, that's the day that um, many con most conspiracy theories um, believe the or believe that conspiracy theories start originated from. And the reason it's that date was because it was May the 18th, 1307, and the reason they accept it as the origin of conspiracy theories, or something along those lines, were, is because of what the church did, what happened on that day. And so, pretty much everyone on earth has heard of the Knights Templar, a group of warrior monks who, yeah, that's not an actual thing, that's the actual description for them, um, who guarded the passage between the holy city of Jerusalem and the rest of the Christian Empire. And they had their base on the Temple Mount, and so seven years after they'd been assassinated in 1307, um, it was their last known Grand Master was assa assassinated, executed for crimes against the church. And that's the day, the year, the day, the month, the year that conspiracy theories accept to be the origin of them. And that's because it gave them a reason for, gave, gave secret society is a reason in somebody to hate because they've killed one of the most killed off one of the most essential essential powerful groups I'm really bad with English today uh, powerful groups of people ever and so yeah, but I'm not sure I believe that conspiracy theories started on, started in 
13, 14. Yeah, May the 18th, 13, 14. I think it happened seven years prior. Um, on Friday the 13th, August 13.07. And this is actually where Friday the 13th gets all its bad luck from. And so what happened was the church her, had supposedly found out that the Templars were committing crimes against God or something. And they decided that they'd assassinate the majority of them, took into took um, into custody the Grand Master of the Templars, and who was later executed seven years later. And yeah, and people, people, the main reason for it, for fight. For um, this was because um, they'd been apparently committing crimes against God, and some conspiracy theorists um think such as myself think that the church decided, you know what, they've got too much power. I'm going to take it away from them by killing them because yay. The only people they the church um, took orders from was the Pope, and so the uh, and so so yeah, and I believe this was the origin of conspiracy theories because ever since then we've discovered tunnels underneath the Templars original bay and it looked like they were looking for some of it and we just conspiracy theorists just believe the church not the church, the Templars went underground and just off the radar, disguise, disguising, basically, you know those TV uh, stories where, on TV programs where people, there's been a story where they're supposed to be dead and they take advantage of that. Yeah, quite a few conspiracy theories, quite a you conspiracy theorists actually believe that that's what the that's what the Templars have done, and if so, it could be very very dangerous for the church. And it actually has been, but more about that in the next episodes. And that was the first episode of conspiracy theories. Subscribe.